Okay, so as you can see, we're back in the studio. So we're actually able to get some golfers hitting some golf balls. And the tip today is more to do with setup position and just something that we're seeing quite a lot of players struggle with. Quite simply, when we're seeing golfers take their setup too often, the rear end is pushed back too much. So the pressure gets too much into the player's heels. Now the big problem with this is there's nearly always a reaction. So we start too much in the heels as we're on our way down then we start seeing this tip over towards the toes, which we definitely don't want. So, as a way to check that you've got the correct amount of hip bend, you're gonna need a wall. So very simply, just measure off uh, the size of a club head, about three, four inches away from the wall. Now take your normal golf setup, making sure you just bend forward from the hips, but the key is don't let your backside hit the wall. Okay, if your backside hits the wall, you're pushing too far back, your weight's gonna be, and your pressure will be too much into your heels. That's a no-no. Okay, so just bend forward just a little bit and then take your posture. Okay, so your backside shouldn't hit the wall if you're doing it correctly. Now as an added bonus tip to this, what you also can do, just with regard to how the, the pressure is into your feet, is to make sure that once you've got this correct, you can still raise your toes up inside of your shoes. If you can't, you've now gone a bit too far the other way and the weight's too far out towards the toe. So it's this Goldilocks, too hot, too cold, just right type of scenario. So. Bend forward from the hips, don't let the backside touch the wall, take the setup, but then make sure you can just wriggle your toes inside of your shoes. If you do this in barefoot, this will really, really help you.